The nurse is assessing a client experiencing motor loss as a result of a left-sided cerebrovascular accident. Which clinical manifestations would the nurse document? A. Hemiparesis of the client's left arm and apraxia. B. Paralysis of the right side of the body and ataxia. C. Homonymous hemianopsia and diplopia. D. Impulsive behavior and hostility toward family members. The correct answer is B. Paralysis of the right side of the body and ataxia. Rationale, the most common motor dysfunction of a CVA is paralysis of one side of the body. In this case with a left-sided CVA, the paralysis would affect the right side. Ataxia is an impaired ability to coordinate movement. Homonymous hemianopsia and diplopia are visual field deficits that a client with a CVA may experience, but they are not motor losses.